This is SFC Spectacular. You're in CYC for all things entertaining on this and every other channel I own. Welcome back. Welcome back. Another quick rant. Another quick rant. And if you've looked at the title, this is about hot tub streamers and why they are pieces of... Let me stop. But uh, hot tub streaming and uh, cam girls, whatever you want to call these chicks. I've been talking it for about it for a while. I've seen videos <clears throat> of other YouTubers, content creators making... Uh, having conversations about this particular topic for quite some time, probably, probably about a year, six, eight months, something to, but I guess at the turn of this COVID thing, when you know, everything started and these girls got hip to the game that, hey, maybe I should go get a hot tub, sit in my my hot tub and, and have a banana or floaty or whatever and sit on it and just be a lazy piece of shit and collect money. Now, I'm gonna say this to you. I do not hate the player. I hate the game though. And the game that we're looking at now is uh, the downfall of Twitch. And it seems to be obvious. So first off, if you don't know what hot tub streaming is, that's when one of these girls on Twitch specifically, I should say, because I don't think YouTube allows it. I haven't seen it yet. But specifically, they get a hot tub, a pool, or something of that nature, put it in their backyard, put it in their room, make way, and they get in a bikini, and they float around, and they talk to all their simps, simpanzees, whatever you want to call them. And they collect money. So in one respect, it is, it's quite smart. If people are willing to give you the money, then why not take the money? You know what I mean? I'm reminded of a, a quote from, what is it? Uh, Black Dynamite. And Black Dynamite's father told him, man, as long as these people keep giving me my money, I'm gonna keep taking it. Simple. So that's what they're doing. They're just cultivating men who are lonely. I, won't, I don't wanna say they can't get women. I don't think most of these men can't get women or young men or maybe the little kids that watch these girls can't, but um, they're, I'm quite sure there's some older guys who watch. I watch uh, Amber from time to time, even though she's kind of a racist. No. Allegedly, she's a, you know, she's a little, she's, she has said the N word on stream and tried to cover it up, so don't get at me. Google it. But uh, I watch and I sit in there and it's funny. Uh, they wait around the pool, they write your name on whatever little thing they have, says you subbed. <laughs> And we all feel good. But I don't know. Anybody else out there who's ever been in there, get like that. You get this funny feeling in there. Like there's, there's the proverbial elephant in the room. Like you can't say anything about her being naked, but she's naked. Like you might say, man, that girl's got a big old ass. And then moderator descends on you. Comic gone. Before you even get a chance, you could type three of them. And it, it pew, moderator's on you, fam. So basically what I'm saying is you could sit in that room, but you're not allowed to talk about how hot she is. You better not mention her titties. You bet not mention she got a bikini on, even though she has a bikini on. That's not, that's not, no. No, pretend like you don't even see her. You know, the talk in there is kind of like, hey, you sure are smart. Wow, how'd you get this room set up like this? It's just obvious, it's just dumb questions that these simps ask to the, this titty streamer. But let me say this too, I gotta move on. I watched a clip by Asmongo here, and uh, he talked, it's, it's called Comments on the Absolute State of Twitch, and he, he, I gotta state this. He doesn't want to talk about it, and he did say somebody's gonna use it as a clip to. But yes, they are as go. This is the internet, so you're quite a smart man. And in this particular, I'm gonna play it for you. Then I'm gonna talk about it after this. So let's let's get over to the gym room, and let's play this clip real quick. What is? I mean, the thing is, like, these aren't children. I mean, these these girls are in, these are intelligent women. Like, don't ever fool yourself into thinking that any of these girls are actually stupid. They're not stupid. They know exactly what they're doing. Many of them have college degrees, and they're very well educated, and they're really good at what they do. That's why they're millionaires, because they're doing it. There's plenty of hot girls on the website, and they're doing way better. It's naive, and I think it's coping to think that it was just all an accident. These girls are not stupid. They know exactly what they're doing. And I have no problem, as I said, I, I don't care. I have to say this like 50 fucking times because I don't want people to co-opt what I'm saying into some fucking incel rant. So, sometimes people gonna co-opt it into an incel rant. as my goal. So I just wanna let you know that. <laughs> well, back to what I was saying. He is right and he is wrong at the same time. These women are smart and they are not smart. They are smart in the fact that yes, they realize this is an opportunity to cultivate money from these, from these so-called, as he as he would put it, incels. Um, <clears throat> they are not smart in the fact that they, the long term, 
for both Twitch and their future is not good. I, I think that it seems fun now to put on a bikini, jump in the tub, make all the money you can, but that's short-sightedness. Because in 10 years, where will you be? Nobody knows, but I, I bet you will not be in a hot tub on Twitch. I bet money on that you will not be in a hot tub on Twitch. And who will want to hire you? Hmm? And when all that, man, women spend money like, like that proverbial water in the tub. They'll spend it up. It'll all be gone. Then what? That's when they come looking for men to bail them out. And they blame men for the whole. I heard a hot tub girl blame a man. It's their fault if they didn't watch. Holy shit. Are you kidding me? I guess I couldn't watch a movie if the movie theater never opened. But if the movie theater opened and, and say, hey, we're showing Terminator 2, quite clearly they want me to come see Terminator 2, don't they? They didn't open, pay money, set up, hire people for me not to go see Terminator 2, right? So what kind of foolishness is that? Of course, men are gonna come watch. Hey, some women, how come we not think about the women that's watching the TNA? Come on. Or are we foolish to think that it's only many of these hot tub streams? These women trip me out, man. They, they, they kill me. I wanna call them some other words, but you know, I don't wanna violate TLS because you know how YouTube isn't that much friendly about it either, but I don't know, it's crazy. And I've talked to a lot of people about trying to shut this thing down, both on Twitch and YouTube. And I, I, I applaud all the YouTubers and other content creators who do down it and talk about it. and Because it, it is going to drag Twitch to hell. If you're watching this right now and you're one of those guys over at Twitch that's struggling and wonder why you can't get any views, wonder no more, brother. Wonder no more. This is one of the reasons. It could be because you're dry and boring. But I bet it, you ain't got no titties and ass. <laughs> you can't, whatever you're doing can't be half as entertaining as that, buddy. So wonder no more, sir or man or whoever you are and to the ladies who let this go on shame on you shame on you so when somebody comes in your stream and asks you to show their titties or ask you for a sandwich or something, oh you can get mad at them but, but just know that it's allowed other places it's allowed in the hot tub stream i've seen it sexist comments all day and it's allowed well you can't just mention that naked you can't mention the obvious you can say some sexist shit like man i bet she could make the shit out of a sandwich and she'd be like <laughs> But if you said, hey, that bitch is making a sandwich. <laughs> Cut you right off right there. Cut you right off right there. Um, This is just a little rant. I'm throwing all my game is so spectacular channel, man. And, and it really does kind of bother me, but not so much. Because I'll be all right in 10 years. I'm retired. I'll be good. But uh, it worries me about the platforms. And I will say this. I don't think content creation is, is too much longer for this planet. Meaning, in about five years, this, this thing will dry up. Both... I want to say YouTube's going to be gone, but YouTube's going to be a different place again as it has changed in the last five to ten years. And Twitch will probably be gone. I'm pretty sure it'll be gone because mostly because Twitch staff doesn't want to make changes. And they allow stuff like this to go on. So why wouldn't they? I put in my, I put in an email for my resignation from the affiliate program. I'm not noble. I'm not, I don't want any applaud. And that's not what I'm saying it for. All I'm saying is I can't, if I'm going to talk it, I guess I get a better live it too. So I'm removing myself from Twitch shortly. I think the only streams I'll do there from now on will be Fridays. 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, my uh, streamer's bartender. And that's because most people there are, are used to that. <clears throat> so if it, if, it, if it continues to get a crowd, I'll keep doing it there. Otherwise, all my other streaming will be here on Game is So Spectacular. And you can check out my other content, videos, and other stuff. I got videos coming up this week and next week on SFC Spectacular. Hey, look down for links below. Check me out. Hey, make sure you give a like, a comment. But most of all, share this with a friend because you know what? That's the only thing that's going to get this popping above the above the rim, the so-called algorithm. You know, um, you got to share it to your Facebook, your Twitter, your Instagram, wherever you can. Share this video, any other video you like of mine, so I can grow a little bit. You know, get a little bigger, maybe hmm, talk a little bit more shit. All right, hey, uh, if you want to see more videos like this, let me know down in the comments. I'm gonna get out of here. I got some stuff to do for Mother's Day, and I hope you have a good Mother's Day too. I was gonna make a Mother's Day video, but not really. Hey, remember, guys. If it can't be good, remember, if it can't be good, be good at it. I'm out of here, guys. Peace. What's good, spectacular soldiers? If you're like me, you're upset that video's over. Fear not. Check out the videos listed below. Still bored? Then check out my other YouTube channel, Gaming So Spectacular. We require more content, I hear you exclaim. Well, then take a trip over to my Instagram, Twitter, 
or Twitch, where I stream weekdays. And luckily for you, the name is the same everywhere. Until next time, Spectacular